One quick attack clicked off. Fuck you're dating! Give the 53 motherfucking months, how you doing? Okay, it would normally pop up and tell me he can't evolve. The daylight about to break. Or is the moon that bright? No, the sun's coming up. Are we gonna go to a higher leveled area so he gets more from it? Because it didn't. I felt like I had Cleffa evolving by now. Which is a little weird. What the fuck am I doing? I want the wrong menu. I can check his happiness now, good point. Yeah, we'll do that. Because we made a lot of rounds, he broke a lot of shit, I'll see if that helped. Alright, where is this? Are you happiness guy? Nope. Happiness guy is older. Are you happiness guy? Evithy. I raise the white flag. Nothing wrong with that. I do not. I never expect anybody to stay with me for like you know all ten or twelve hours of these overnight streams. So never feel bad about tapping out, going to bed. A bit friendly, but a ways to go. Yeah, how does rapid? How does fucking Cherim feel about me? Oh, you're giving up on Zorark. Oh shit, I see you. Okay, so Eva didn't hardly get shit from that, but when I did that with Cleffa, she was ready so fast. I went up Duck on Dad. So let's go to the Cornet Highlands and try this again. Plus I'm on ninth this month. Hey, me too. Me too. Alright, this is a good way to test my theory. The theory being, if you see, because instead of getting 15, per, uh, 15 experience per hit. Evithy is getting 100. Just because of the zone we're in. Never tapping, y'all are lunatics. I appreciate it. You need experience for that one. No experience for eating the plant. Good to know. But anyway, instead of 15 a pop, he's getting 100 a pop. Which is just, I mean, obviously so much more. Oh, a regular Heracross. If I have Heracross maxed or I'd care a lot more, but... God damn, that Mothram is huge. Two Alpha Mothram, what are the odds? Maybe they just show up here. Maybe this is their home. That's your home ball, don't you want to go home? I'm sure you're some of the most fun I can have a relaxing here. Helps with getting real school stuff done. Yeah, yeah, no. This is uh, this is definitely like... Like, not always, obviously. It's got its moments, but a lot of this is... Oh, fuck. Hi, Clover. A lot of this is really good stuff to throw into the background, which is what I look for half the time. Like, when I'm playing TFT, I don't look for streams that I have to be involved in. I look for streams I can throw in the background. That's it for me. Later, uh... Speak. Have a good night. Okay, Eevee, what are the odds you live a single hit from this Obama snow? Maybe we're faster. 
We're faster. Okay, sick. Come back, Eevee. You did your best. Anyway, Rapidash. Uh, kill this bitch. Oh, she still only had the one. How did I lose? I think Petal will just learn uh, Petal Dance. Or Liligant, excuse me. Puff, three Stardust. I like the way our girl looks. I like her design right now quite a bit. Uh, Liligant learned a new move. Leaf Blade and Leaf Storm, 85, 100. With a high crit chance. Or 110 90 with recoil. Oh, wait, no. And it lowers your stats. Okay, so this is like an all out blow. That's also special. She doesn't have a high special attack. Oh, there's Victory Dance. User performs a dance to usher in victory. This raises the user's offense and defensive stats and increases the damage dealt by the user's move. What the fuck? Yo! Are you fucking. That's the most broken shit I've ever heard in my life. The level of fucking disgusting. The level of fucking disgusting. One setup move, literally one turn. Offense and defense is up and whatever damage you deal is up by 50. She one shots everything. I'm glad we dropped Cleaver for this, because holy shit, look at this thing. But anywho. Oh, fuck. Get up the goddamn... Yeah, that move is insane. Hold on. Okay, sorry. Oh my god, it just occurred to me I have to do this. Fuck! Oh, my fault. Two things occurred to me just now. Number one, I have to do this again with Espeon. And number two, I'm doing this in the daylight. Because I'm stupid. I didn't wait till night first. Over the past three weeks, I've watched the entire TSRP playlist and the entire squad. God damn, Dokkan Dad. You're going all in. Fuck, I can't believe all that shit during the day. I wonder if that, like, negates my progress or, like, swayed me in favor of... SP on progress. Okay, so it's based on happiness, but it's not when they're raised. I guess the way it always worked in my head in Gen 2. Wanda? I I have never had to use Ursa Luna to find Wanda. Let it be known. I guess Gen 2 always left me under the impression that if you raise it in the daylight, it sways you towards the daylight. And if it, 
Yeah. And if you raise it at night time, it sways you towards... Kind of like the way it shall work. You know, like when you raise certain shall stats, it sways you one way or the other. I used to think that Sneasler was a mean Pokemon since he looked sly and unsavory, but it helped me out in a tight spot. It must be good after all. I still don't like Sneasler. Where the fuck am I? Take me back to where I was. Oh, I'm in hell. I'm not in hell, I'm just not where I was. Just race friendship, then you can choose. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Anyway, it occurred to me I have to do this all over again with Eevee to get Espeon here in a little bit. Which, you know, will just be a blast, really. I don't like Sneasler because they just made a better Toxicroak. Is Sneasler poison type? Never actually fought one. I've only caught a couple and right around on the back of one. On the flip side, this is really good for me recollecting. This is really good for me recollecting uh, supplies and shit. Because frankly, I needed to. What up, Gibble, you little dickhead? Anyway, later. Really good excuse for me to just, uh... You got a shiny umbra on? Oh, yeah, shiny umbra on, like, stick because the blue. Hey, thanks, Machine, for the host, man. I guess hearing that jingle, I'm hearing a jingle. That's not a normal Golbat color. That's not a normal Golbat color. Oh, machine. Oh, yeah, machine. No, I see you. Uh, fuck, Chad. I'm nervous. This is full odds. I think I kill him. Ferocious, thank you for the raid. I'm currently panicking. How you guys doing? What do I fight him with? Just throw balls at him? You think he'd stay? I mean, shit, we can try it. I don't know when I got 93 Ultra Balls, but let's go. Hi, currently panicking, I'm dead. Yeah, so basically, I don't know how no, how much you guys know Pokemon, but you, you just came in on, this is a shiny, right? They, they normally don't look like that. So this one's special, but they're like really rare, is the kicker. So you guys came in at a good time, I guess. Appreciate the, appreciate the raid, Frosha. And thank you, Machine, again. Got his ass. Let's go. All right. That's shiny number five. And that is the second full lot. I heard a weird noise, and I was like, what's going And then I turned the corner, I was like, that's just a shadow. I was like, that's not just a shadow. That gold bat is fucking green. Can't even look like that. All right, well, y'all brought the luck. Thank you, thank you. Update stream title. I've had it for one second. But yeah, you're right, I should. Up the shiny count, boys. Anyway, I don't have a problem. I just streamed this game yesterday for 12 hours, and we're at nine and a half hours today, is the point. Any count? Five. Why are so many? I don't know why this game loves its green shinies, but I hate it. 
I think if they really wanted to like put a point home, it's like, well, the shiny variations make sense because they blend in with the wild or whatever, but. Okay, I guess that crowbat just hangs out over here. Isn't it a color palette thing? No, originally it was a color palette thing in the OG games because they only had so many options. They only had so many ways they could go with it. But over time, they actually started changing some Pokemon shiny. That color palette excuse only works for... Like, literally Gen 1 and maybe Gen 2. But by Gen 3, that color palette thing didn't exist anymore. Ah, fuck. I don't feel like dealing with that. Oop, he hurled mud at me. Crowback gonna fuck me up too, or like, what's going on? Good work, Eevee. We're leaving now. I have a hard time. Oh, I should save my game. I have a hard time believing this uh, Eevee can't evolve yet. It just happened so fast with Cleffa. But I don't know what I did different. Wisp! Maybe it's because Cleffa leveled up a couple times. I don't know. I don't know. Don't know. He's steel type yet. He is. Means I don't feel like doing this. Keep it. Keep your rocks. This chop shiny looks like stages of kidney failure. Oh, okay. Sure. Anyway, so this blue color is what gold bats normally look like, but I have a green one now, so. That's a thing. Um, I get. Is this a. Wait. Oh, I thought. I was like, am I looking at an eclipse? But I'm not. I guess we go back and check Happiness Guy and see if that was any better. If not, my only other thing that I could think of would just be to level Eevee up. Watching one of your videos while cooking supper, one of the kids asked me, "What is meth?" Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if leaving the children on <laughs> with old T shot in the background is, is the way to go necessarily, but I'm not here to tell you how to parent. Yeah, I caught two Pokemon. One of them shiny. What of it? I just banged the shit out of my knee on my table. You know, you know how we do. Clip was hard, couldn't fit in the whole thing. Thank you, Rumple. You guys know, I, you know what's interesting? I guess it's not that interesting because this game, shiny, they give out shinies like candy. Golbat was one of the only legit shinies I ever got. I got like a handful, like five or less shinies when we've been doing ROM hack playthroughs and even when I was a kid. Because the odds are like one in eight fucking thousand or whatever. 
But we got a goal. I think we got a goal bet in one of the early Emerald Randomizer runs. He just showed up, and I'm like, well, guess we're using a crow bat. Near the end of the game. Uh, what am I doing? Oh, I'm talking to Happiness Guy. Now I see how compatible you and your Pokemon are. Alright, Turbo Nerd, what do you got? Maybe seems to get on well with you, but I'm sure it could get... Okay, so that... I feel like that also didn't help that much. I should have put two EV in my inventory. I should have put two EV in here. Ran around a lot. I feel like leveling's gonna help more. I guess we can go kill Blissey again. Or we can look for some shiny Whirlpool. Always wanted a blue Whirlpool. Okay, what does the dex look like? Because... I was thinking about maxing this out. Throw a Wurmple out and use Poison Sting 25 times. That'd be the big one. Nah, let's just... Fuck it, let's just go. Diamond Armor. Yeah, they're about where I thought they'd be. Alright, these weren't all about to have the fucking... There we go. I'm gonna go around here to avoid the ankle-breaking fall off the mountain that would... ...obviously happen. Come on, when do you gotta be blue? Oh, fucking Alpha spawned in. I think I actually will reset for this, because this one is just so easy to farm, I might as well. You, you know what I mean? I feel like the Wurmple here is so easy to reset on. Like, why not? The only thing I hate is the idea of wasting, like, 20 Ultra Balls on Wormhole, but... If one of them's a Shiny, I guess it's fine. Shiny Fox. Oh, are you still looking for Zora? Out of Bonsley, I do not look forward to having to find Bonsley. You've been at it for some hours, Lunar Nike. Oh, fuck, Teddy Ursa. Nah, I'm doing Wurmple. I know where the Wurmple one is, it's in a really easy spot. Teddy Ears is also kind of a cool one. I'm not like dying for Teddy Ears. I'm not dying for Wormpole. I just seems easy. What the fuck am I doing? Save. Save. Save the game. Slaughtering the rest? Oh, you're evil. Oh my god, I bet. Off myself. All right, we're good. Don't look over here. Nothing's over here. Oh, fuck. Wait, 
Wormful Shiny is super cool, too. That's kind of why I want it. Well, it, like, it isn't su super cool because it's a fucking Wormful, but, like, it looks cool because it's blue. Very confusing method. It's not too bad once you've done it once or twice. Did that ball miss. You kick out of an ultra ball. You're a goddamn worm. You exist in real life. He just, I don't know if you guys saw that. He Ultra Instinct phased out of existence. I literally threw an Ultra Ball at him and he phased out of existence. He was right there, I threw the ball, he disappeared for a second, so my ball knocked off the rock, and then he reappeared in the exact same spot. Alright, we go to Jube Life, and then we go back. Go back to our wormhole friend. Hit the Venus 5S. Hit the fucking save game. We have 180 of what? 242? Is that how many Pokemon are in this game? And I haven't even entered the last region. We're, too, we're not doing too shabby. And we've maxed most of their stats, so... Fuck where the worm pull at? Over here. Over here. Okay. I fought OG. That one spazzed out. Why do I always do heavy ball? You're a worm! Stay in the ball! I don't know where these worms are getting John Cena's strength to kick out of an Ultra Ball. It don't matter where we set in this one. Filling the page of a Pokemon ups the rate. Yeah, that's what chat tells me. 246 Pokemon. Some of us will never complete it because you need Diamond and Pearl. Oh, fuck. No, I have Diamond and Pearl. You know what I don't have? I don't have Sword and Shield. Or I have Diamond, I guess. I don't have Pearl. But I don't have Sword and Shield. I might have to have some of you guys trade me the Sword and Shield mon so I can max out their decks and then trade them back. Unless they, for some reason, lock them to where you can't trade them, because that's racism. That's racism of the highest order. Because if I put all the work for this fucking Dex in, I will have to buy a sword, and I, I hate that. Hearing reports of one of those outbreaks.
I forgot. Yeah, I forgot you needed that the specifics for those though. One time I think it'd be cool to roll up and see the shiny from far away. I just have it stick out compared to the rest. That one's twerking. I was looking for the, the dark blue to spawn in. done. And we try again. You got five shinies? I do. I do. One of them's kind of cheating because they sort of give you one if you play a certain side quest. They just kind of hand it to you. And it also sucks because it's a really cool shiny, but now it's lame because everybody has it. But... Yeah, two of them I found were just randomly in the wild, and then two of them I, I did what I'm doing here, where I kind of look for them. Which one? Which one do they give you for free on the side quest? They give you Ponyta, which is a really cool blue color, and it's it's a dope shiny, but it's like... I don't even want this shiny Ponyta anymore, man. Everybody has one. But then I I would like to see him. Let me finish this. I don't know how long this will take, but let me do this because I'm kind of in the middle of it. But if I get this worm pull, I'll show you all of them. I'll pull them all out because we'll have six. We'll have a full team. We'll have the full shiny squad. Oh, wait. I have to save. Got a shiny tart wig. Nice. Yeah, it'd just be so cool to roll up and just see the blue in the first four. I don't know why I like that idea so much, but... I do. Too far. Fucking bitch. This grass is just barely too far to be comfortable. When trying to catch these guys. What the fuck? They're vanishing. They stop spawning. I feel like I lost. I feel like it was a small wave. I just lost them pretty quick there. Trying to get a Rosalia, and then I'll have a full team of six. Oh, nice. What are you trying to do right now? So this is how you shiny hunt in the game basically, is you wait for an outbreak, because outbreaks have really high odds of shiny spawns. Um, and then if it's an outbreak of a Pokemon you want, or in my case, in this one, the Pokemon's just really close. This is an easy outbreak to get to. Um, you load up. Or you go to the outbreak, you save at the camp before you get to the outbreak. Then you go to the outbreak, you clear it out. And if no shiny spawns, well, it's the game says, oh, the outbreak's over, right? Um... But you can kind of negate that by resetting the outbreak. And the way you reset the outbreak is if no shiny spawns, you reset the game, turn it off, back on. Then you have to leave, come back to this village, and then turn around and go back out. And that's just to make sure you don't get all the exact same Pokemon you got before. Because if you get all the exact same Pokemon you got before, you know none of them are going to be shiny. So after doing all this, you just kind of... Just kind of puts a reset button on everything. And then you go and you try the outbreak again. 
And I don't even care for a Wurmple that much. The only reason I'm doing this one, like I, I, did, I think the shiny Wurmple is cool, but like I don't need it, right? The reason I'm doing this one is because it's just, it's so close. It's just so easy to get to. It's like, why not? They're really not that spawning. There's so many. I'm probably gonna just reset now. They're not respawning anymore. Two Wurmples watching. Yeah, the two ones watching me just catch all their friends from a distance was a little weird. Shiny Yanma, man. Sometimes I think being in this chat brings in the shiny luck. We have people catching shinies in here all fucking night. They're not even, half the time, they're not even hunting for them. Somebody in here a minute ago said that they were about to go start shiny hunting Machop because a, a Machop outbreak happened. And before they got to the outbreak, a different shiny Machop just showed up in front of them. Except for Cleffa and Riolu, I have one of every base Pokemon. So all I have to do is evolve them to fill the decks. So you're getting there. The time where I wish I actually had Wurmple's whole page filled out, because holy shit, I probably would have seen like four by now if I did. He spawned so far away. Oh my god, it's fucking purple. I think I missed him. Get in the ball! It was purple. I thought it'd be blue. Get in the ball. Another one in the books, boys! Well, good work, everyone. Congratulations all around. We got the shiny. Oh, now I can show Sheffy the thing. God, Eevee was with us when we caught so many Pokemon just now. That is six. Though I don't think it'd be possible to beat this game with my shiny team. Now only ha I might not evolve it. I don't know what shiny Beautifly looks like. It's probably really good. I don't know what shiny Dust Talks looks like either. Or any of them. I just know I like the way shiny Wormpole looks. I thought he was bluer though. That one's purple. Firm handshakes all around. Quick little grind fest. We were able to knock that one out. Gotta get another shiny. I would have to get another shiny and hope that they both didn't turn into the same thing. I wonder if you can game it. Because somebody said it's completely random when if it turns into Cascoon or Silcoon. I wonder if that's decided before it evolves or not. Like, I wonder if you save your game before it evolves or before it gets to the level where it can evolve. It's decided when you encounter it? Okay, okay, okay. 
Figured it was worth a shot. Wormadam. Wormadam level 20. Eevee, kill it. Good job, Eevee. I don't know why I have an eerie. I've ever... You guys hear that? What the fuck was that noise? Get in clip now. Appreciate you. Oh, it was me switching my. Anyway. Oh, thank you, Rumple. I have this weird belief that as soon as the Eevee levels up, that'll be what pushes him over the happiness. But what do I know anyway? Okay, Sheffy, are you here? Look at the Wurmple! He's a purple boy! I thought he was blue! Wormpole data. We almost have the page full. Not that it matters because we already have the shiny, but I could just make a fucking living out of catching a bunch of shiny Wormpole. What up, Roberts? What is going? Yeah, the seeing the Pokemon saves is a classic. That's where the Pokeball was. That up, that up, you, 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 gone, gone, gone. Out of here, pop, 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 pop. Crazy to think I actually need more satchel space. All right, are we gang ganging? Actually, test my Eevee again, fucko. I got it. I did, Chef. You want to see the? You want to see the whole squad? All right. Let me let me dig him out of the old pastures. Okay. Oh, I can't take them all out on account of that would be... I wouldn't have a team. Uh... Oh, yeah, I haven't moved Golbat. yet either oh god where is gold bet into the front oh shit chat i bet gold bet got filled into one of these weird squares early on keep an eye out for him i hate trying to find shit in here oh there he is got him got him got him Let's get a look at our first shiny gang.
There they are, shiny squad. They vibe. How good would this team be? I'd have one fire fighting, one just straight fire. That's bad already. We'd have water steel, it's good coverage. Poison flying. Another water. No, this team would suck. This team sucks ass. We'd have an electricity weakness and a ground weakness. Pippo would be sitting. But yeah, the ponytail is the one they give to everybody. You just do a side quest in the game, you just get the ponytail. You know what? That was good looks, because I need to move all the shinies into their own box anyway. Tell me I can't just do this. No, 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 no. We're not releasing. Phew. There we are. Can you ride it? No, you can only ride this specific Pokemon they let you. It's like, I can only ride that big dumb deer thing. And then a couple other Pokemon, depending on what I'm trying to do. Morning, goddess. How you doing? Good to see you. Uh, what's the plan, Stan? What was I doing before? Oh, we were gonna go kick Blissey's ass again. Hunter outbreak. Gengar doesn't look that great. I don't care enough. Let's go kick Blissey's ass. Doing great. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Short little stream today, but we're having fun. We're having fun. You have the decks done? No. No, still working on it. Currently trying to get an Umbreon. Currently trying to get an Umbreon, and Cherim needs to hit level... 47. Oh, fuck! The goddamn Alpha Eevee! That's a goddamn Alpha Eevee! Eh. That Bidoof is still asleep. Nice! He's caught an Alpha Eevee. Do I have EXP candies? I do, but I've been trying to save them. I've just been running up and kicking Blissey's ass instead. I could do a... I could just do a battle. I might just do that. As soon as I get Eevee to Umbreon, we'll just, we'll just do a battle. Against the, some of the other trainers the old guy brings up. No rapid ash today, is it? Because it's raining. Yeah, I've been intentionally sitting on the candies. So I'm trying to do what I do in every other Pokemon game. Where I wait for, like, either the, the fucking Elite Four or the post game. And then I punch the rare candies and EXP candies and everybody so they we get a bunch of levels off that. Is the idea. But... I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to make it this time or not. Does the Alpha become the Espeon? Ooh, do we want an Alpha Espeon or an Alpha Jolteon? 
I think it'll depend on its nature. We'll let the nature decide. It can be anything except an Umbreon. Or a Sylveon or a Leafeon. Because I'm working on the Umbreon now and I already have Leafeon and Sylveon maxed. But other than that, it can be anything at once. What well, Pokemon is your highest level and what is it? It's Samurott. It's my starter. Boring answer, but he's level 68. Still kicking ass. The Stantler actually looked like they were fighting. Like the way Deer fought, it was kind of neat. Oh yeah, no, you're right. I caught an Alpha Gudra. And he's level 70. I'm not using him. It's an Alpha Gudra with a huge fucking ass. It's level 70, but I'm not using him. Good call, Rumpel. I forgot about that. Fuck up there. Is there a wisp up here? Felt like a wisp zone. It's possible there was, and I got it already. But yeah, I don't want that one. That Graveler doesn't look that big for an Alpha Graveler. What do I know? I don't hear Blissey. Be here, though. Oh, shit, Happeny. I don't even need this thing. Nos, hey. How you doing? to see you disproving that shiny hunting is hard. It's free! Oh, wait, I gotta update my counter. I actually just caught a shiny Wurmple. I'm not even hunting half the time, Nos. Two of them are full odds, one of them they get to you for free, and then three of them I actually looked for. Ooh, that was a crit. That's scary. Yeah, I understand entirely, Nos. Thank you for the 44 months. Thank you for the, Thank you for the host, bud. Appreciate you. Don't die. Fuck! Uh, this might kill Rapidash, but I'm going to try it anyway. Actually, we'll test it out with an Agile style one first. Oh no, he he could live. She could live it fine. She could live it fine. I was worried that a Flare Blitz on a Blissey, the recoil would kill, the recoil alone would kill Rapidash. 
God, I'm probably better off just catching that thing. Than I am getting a full-blown Blissey. I think next time I come up here, I'm going to do that. It just makes more sense. Still upset Lilligant didn't get to, uh... This is a regular ass chancy up there. I'm upset Lilligan didn't get the AXP. What's up, fucker? Oh, okay. I think he's a wiener. I just wanted the experience. I didn't want to catch it or nothing. You kind of like that the Mach Choke are the protectors. Like, no, they're not aggro. Off rip. Well, let's look for Combi while we're over here. Oh, wait. I was going to go in the cave, too. Then we'll look for Combi. Going in the cave, because there's a bunch of fucking rock. Oh, cannonball! All right. Uh, yeah, fuck it. Let's look for Combi and get the fuck out of here. Make it nighttime. Umbreon time, boys! Woo! Where the fuck are the Combi? Never can find the combi. No fairy moves. I got rid of baby doll eyes, Zark. Shoutouts to you. Male. Gross. You. Male. Gross. Male. Gross. Ten percent chance. I heard it was one in eight. Either way, really low odds. Male. Oh my God, what is this? A Twitch chat? It's a fucking sausage fest out here. What does the X mean? X mean I'm not allowed to focus on this one. I caught that one because it wouldn't let me look at it. I don't want to accidentally be wrong, you know? Isn't it main-ish Pokemon game where you can't breed? Yeah, and honestly, you should be able to breed. The little BS that you can't. I'm gonna go try to catch the Vespa Queen. This is where Scyther hangs out at. I'm gonna trip to your grandma, but I'm different. Uh, I think we pass. Don't we pass Vespa Queen to get to Lolpunny? Isn't that how that works? If I'm thinking of the right area. Hell, it's nighttime. It might just be a dust tox now. Due to the time of day. Is Vespa Queen not here? Further up this way. Male. Gross. 
Is it night? I'll save before I go. In Cotton's Edge. Where the fuck am I? I thought there was one over here. There is another one in another area, though, you're right. I just thought someone also spawned here. Um, dust talks are out, so I guess, yeah, good call. Good call, brethren. Do it now, Eevee! Yeah, I got rid of baby doll eyes. We got the Umbo. That Evo look that Evo animation looks so sick for Umbreon. What does this dex look like for Umbri? Umbreon. It wants me to reteach this bitch baby doll eyes. Uh Dark Pulse. Agile style moves. Oh, it's already Master Dark Pulse. Sick. Uh, quick attack. Come on down. You're out of there. I can reteach a baby doll eyes. That's so hilarious. Okay, so I just added a style some Dark Pulses and we're living. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, man, who cares? Man. I think I can see their pokey dick or whatever from this far away, and that's how I can tell. Fuck, it heard me break my goddamn ankles. Couldn't see, could have been a girl, had to catch you, sorry. Gross, gross. Morning, traders. How you doing? Nope, no Vespa Queen here. I guess that's our next endeavor is catch the Alpha Vespa Queen. It shouldn't be that hard. I've had really good luck with Alphas lately. So, let's go back to the first area. We're going to nap until morning real quick, right? And then Umbreon's gonna help us cull the Shinx population once again. In the Myelins? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I thought, I could have sworn she also showed up there once, but maybe I dreamed that. Stupid a Pokemon could be sleeping and still use other, other moves like Giga Impact. Is that a thing in this game? Does drowsiness still let them use moves even when they're drowsy? Or what, what are you talking about? Because drowsy and sleeping aren't the same thing, obviously. Umbreon's got a move for you. Oh, fuck. Was it stronger? I think it was Agile. I think it was Agile. Should only need to do this three times each. Or maybe not. Fuck, I don't know. I want to battle from the top of the ridge like a badass. Couldn't let me have that, could you? Agile style jutsu. Garchomp used rest, then hit me with a strong style outrage two times back to back. Yeah, no, so Pokemon don't sleep in this game, Alex. Rest doesn't put you to sleep. Rest makes you drowsy. And being drowsy is essentially, from what I understand, being drowsy is essentially the exact same thing as being paralyzed in this game. Which is to say there's a chance you might not do your move. 
But he wasn't sleeping. He made himself drowsy. I was using rest earlier with Munchlax. Yeah, so, like, there's no freezing in this game. It's frostbite. Paralyzation doesn't work the same way it did before in the sense that I, I'm not sure if it slows you down or not. Drowsiness is not sleep. That's not the same. They changed that. Uh, that is two, four, six, eight, ten right there, brother. We're good with Umbreon. We're good with Umbreon, trying to say. Almost Cheerum. Cheerum's, Cheerum's getting... Oh, yeah, we're going to battle. We're going to battle after this. Level up Cheerum. That's so weird. I mean, yeah, what were they going to do, I guess? You know, if, if you get put to sleep, what? The, the opponent just automatically gets three or four turns-ish, depending on their speed, in a row. So they, they swapped it out. It works differently. I don't know how it works different from paralysis. So as of right now, I just assume it does everything paralysis does. But. Oh, yeah, the Alpha Eevee. Eevee maxed, Umbreon maxed, Happiny maxed. Oh, we are so close to level 9. Time to grind another Eevee. Yes! Fuck, I may put the Alpha Eevee in. Just to do this? Actually, let's see what nature the Alpha Eevee is. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Ooh, that's Daddy Gengar. I'm pretty sure. It's hard to tell if this is regular Gengar or Alpha Gengar, because once you catch them, they down they downsize them a bit. I actually don't know if that's Daddy Gengar or not. Okay. Umbreon, you did great. Let me find this Alpha Eevee. Who might have filled... Fuck. Male Combi, Male Combi, Male Combi. Wait, oh wait. Male Combi. Fuck! Okay, the Alpha Eevee filled one of the early slots. And I don't know where it filled it at. Oh yeah, the Alpha Raichu. It's you. Oh, wait, no, this is Pasture 24. Doi. Never mind. That's a regular Eevee. I'm just looking. I have like 40 Eevee, too. This is going to be a nightmare until I find the Alpha. Oh, found the Alpha. Sick. I didn't take long. I don't know why I'm moving you to the end, but you know, Alpha Eevee. What is the nature on this one? Lowered special attack. Fuck! It would have been a perfect Umbreon. Well, I can't make it Jolteon or Umbreon. You know what? I'm actually gonna feed it one of the nature changing mints I have. I guess high speed would be Jolteon, high special attack would be Espeon, but I'm, I'm not sure it really matters. Also collected so many fucking tumble rocks, I'm excited to see how many uh, Ultra Balls I can make. Uh, what did I get rid of that I shouldn't have? I've definitely always had more shit than this. What did I just drop off? Oh, the berries? And the spoiled berries? Unless I got rid of all those. Oh, wait, no, they're there. That's better. That feels more right. And I'll bring those back. Uh, Timid Mitt, speed will grow more easily, but attack will grow more slowly. 
Attack will grow easily, but special attack will grow slowly. That's a Flareon one, but I think I already have a Flareon. Some of these mints suck. I need to plant more mints. Jolly mint. Speed will grow easily, but special attack is down. Ugh. I got the. Sh I got some shitter mints out here. None of these. None of those mints are. Sh none of those mints are good. Not a one. Oh wow! Organized. Never hit that button before. Attack will grow, but special attack. Attack will grow, but special defense. Defense will grow, but speed sucks. Speed will grow, but attack. I think I think we do this, but we do it on Espeon. I think we do Tim and Mint, and then we make this Alpha EV a big ass Espeon. Because I don't think that works on Jolteon, because Jolteon still likes to learn shit like Pin Missile, right? And we're going to go plant mints ASAP. I'm going to need more, I guess. It costs mad money, though. Is it like 10 grand or something to plant the mints? Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight Ultra Balls. I have a hundred Ultra Balls for the first time ever. We're good. We're good for a minute. And make anything else. And I could have money if I wanted it right now. Are the fields not done yet? Surely they're done. Surely they're done. They're done. We're done with the hardest. Real nice. Should be good on apricorns for a minute. Mint harvest, mint harvest. Nice. I have a quest here. No, I have a quest in the middle. Oh, I gotta go return the shit to Zeke. Okay, so two things. Number one, timid mint. On to Eevee. Cool. Number two, we prepare for battle. Oh, actually not yet, though. All right, well, you know what? Hold up. I want to see something. What could you teach an Infernape later, lady? What could you teach an Infernape? Rock Smash, Bulldoze, Aerial Ace, not bad. What's his current moveset look like? I can get rid of Nasty Plot for a fighting type move. Bulk Up. Bulk Up's big. Uh, that raises attack and defense. So Nasty Plot raises attacks to two stages. Bulk Up Bulk up and Calm Mind do the same thing. Those are the same move in disguise in this game. Fire Punch doesn't need to exist when Raging Fury or Flare Blitz does. Drain Punch, that's big. I'd probably do Drain Punch over Nasty Plot. Shadow Claw, Giga Impact, Stone Edge? I think that's the move. If, if I were to run Infernape, Drain Punch over Nasty Plot, Stone Edge over Flamethrower, and then Flare Blitz in place of Raging Fury. That's him. His attack and special attack are the exact same. I was just curious. Is that Iron Fist? Abilities don't exist in this game. Let me battle Wenton. Togepi? I got my Togepi in a different area than the first one. 
Uh, Munchlax, I got really lucky. I've literally only seen Munchlax once the one time I saw him, and I think I caught two of them. Um, do you need an Ice Stone? Do Ice Stones exist? Is that what you need for Glaceon? I might not be able to do Glaceon until I go to the next area, because that's where I'm going to find all the Ice Stones at, I bet. And then Raichu's free. Yeah, T Thunderstone. All right, Security Core Winton, what do you got? Moth him. Level 55, huh? You'll never stand up to my Flare Blitz. Rapid Ash, kill. 